So, uh, great things at Mardi Gras this year, Universal Orlando Resort, Universal Studios Florida Park, uh, 25th year, you got to try our Carnival Tent. New idea we came up with this year, it's a rotating menu. Every two weeks, we have something different to offer the guests. Uh, one of our dishes is from Germany. It's a classic sauerbraten, our red cabbage, our buttered spetzel. Uh, really, really great, and we know how the Germans can put on a festival. Uh, as well, we have from Brazil-themed uh, pau de queijo with a guava dipping sauce, kind of our version of that dish. Um, very savory cheese, and of course the guava balances out with a nice sweetness. Um, moving along, we have some great drinks this year. Um, a couple of collector cups as well. One of my favorites is our cold brew that we're doing. Um, it has cat head pecan vodka. It has uh, a little bit of simple syrup to sweeten it up, but it pairs very well with our beignets. Our beignets we're gonna cook as we go out at our tents. This is in the French Quarter area, which is also known as Gramercy Park. Uh, we do have our classic king cakes that everybody's known forever and loves. Uh, we also have a couple of new items. Uh, our Gator Bites we started last year, real popular. The kids love to be able to say they've eaten alligator. Our Crab Etouffee, also popular. Our Po Boys, a couple of classics you can't go wrong with. One catfish, one is unduly sausage and chicken. Uh, comes with our house cooked kettle chips. And then as we keep going down, one of the things we're real excited about is our plant-based rice cauliflower. So in New Orleans, a real popular dish is our dirty rice. Uh, this year, you run out? Oh. This year, uh, we decided to do it with cauliflower. We mixed it with a plant-based sausage, has garlic, shallots, a little bit of black-eyed peas. Uh, great, great dish. Uh, also our soft shell crab slider, uh, house-made roll, our house-made chips. And then of course, from Trinidad and Tobago, we have a grilled pineapple trini, which is a skewer, and then it also has a kimchi seasoning. So the great thing about this is the kimchi seasoning is a little bit spicy, works well with the sweetness of the pineapple.